what type of influence the second lord is going to produce through different houses you have to mix the significations of the second house which is being carried out by the second lord and the significations of the house where the second lord is going in this particular way we decode these results and this is what we are going to do right now as well first of all if the second lord is going into ascendant I have told you before while dealing about Dhani Yoga that this is a wealth combination and the native is supposed to be very wealthy. Specifically when the Lagna Lord is also powerful and the second Lord in the Ascendant is also powerful. If this second Lord in Ascendant happens to be in Old Trikora Swarashi Varagottam or Digbali in which case if the second Lord is Mercury or Jupiter then it is all the very good and it makes sure that the native is rich. Not only that, second lord in ascendant also indicates that the native is going to have a very sweet voice. And you see, we portray it negatively that this person is, you know, bootlicker or this person is having a very good speech. That's why he's succeeding. But if you look at how the ancients have dealt it, having a good voice, have being sweet-tongued is a virtue. So this person is supposed to be sweet-tongued and because of which he will be quite successful in life and there is nothing bad into it. Why there should be anything bad into it? Second Lord in Ascendant generally makes one very much attached to their family members also. And it can also give one liking for food because of which it can lead to obesity. This is something that the native should be careful about. Health-related issues corpulence, obesity, these problems can be there. However, second lord in the ascendant gives a tendency of enjoyment to the native. The native is enjoyment focused. And if he is not having fun in doing things, then he will not want to do it. Then he will not want to do it. So enjoyment for this person, it is very important that they do things that they enjoy. Generally, these people will have a good eyesight. Not only this, this person will also have a good foresight. And he will generally know what is going to happen in future. In this regard, you can also say that this person is having good intuition. You can also say that this person is having good foresight. Whatever he will plan for future, that things will largely come successful. And again, bad thing is generally we attribute people and we say the person is black-tongued, Kali Jubana is key, and whatever he says comes true. This is also seen in a bad light, which I think people have done because they are not having this virtue. But what I have found, because I have many such people around myself, these people are very critical, very analytical. They live in the moment and they remember things. So because they are critical, they are analytical, they live in the moment, they remember things about people quite well. Based on this, if they say, what is going to happen with the person depending on the nature, behavior, character of the person. And if that comes true, there is nothing very surprising into it, right? So this is not something that should be taken in a wrong sense. This is good. The person have vak siddhi, what we will call it in Sanskrit. And because of which whatever the person predicts or whatever the person says about anyone comes largely true. And the person is quite a visionary and whatever he will do, his plans regarding future and other things will be successful, will fructify, will give him a lot of benefits. The person can also have multiple properties. He will be much attached by his family members and he will be supported by his family members also. You have to remember that if the second lord in, second lord in ascendant is going into a bad condition, planetary war, combustion, debilitation, or in a bad nawamsh, then the result will be entirely opposite. Which means to say, if the second lord <coughs> sorry, is in a good condition in ascendant, we will say that the native is going to have support from family. But if the planet is in a bad condition, in, uh, second lord is in bad condition in ascendant, then we are going to say that the native will not have support from family members. This is how we are going to interpret it. <clears throat> Apart from this, the siblings of second lord in ascendant, the siblings also are quite successful in life. The mother is also successful in life. 
Childrens are fortunate, they do well. These people can suffer misfortune because of a uh, lot of enmity and competition and their enemies can do much harm to them. Marital life, it is not a very good combination for marital life. It can give dissatisfaction or problems in marital life. For longevity, this is a good combination, generally gives a long life. However, person can land in troubles with government and governmental people. It can happen that person can be misguided by some guru or a guru-like figure. In the matters of profession, the person is fortunate if the second lord is in ascendant. If the second lord is in second house itself, then you know second house is powerful. The person is going to be successful. The person is going to be rich. The person is going to be wealthy. And second house we generally see for savings and 11th house for income. Because second lord is in second house, the person will have a lot of savings. And lot of savings should also translate into that the person will leave a lot of inheritance for his dependents after him. The person will have good speech, authoritative speech and working in the area of working in a department where speech is important, customer relationships, radio jockey, news anchor, movie, films and other professions indicated by second house, banking, etc. In these areas, the native will be very successful. Native will generally possess a healthy body and much health problems are not there. Native lives a life of enjoyment, have multiple com have multiple comforts, conveniences, multiple properties, multiple vehicles the native will generally have. But if he is not enjoying something, he cannot keep on doing it for long. So the native have to make sure that he only he is doing only those things that he really enjoy. The native will be supported by family members. He will generally have a very big family, right? Largely family members will also be successful being born in a noble family, being born in a high family, being born in a well-to-do family is a result of second lord being in the second house. Apart from that, the native will also have good foresight. Whatever he will say that will come true and his plannings and his, his plannings will be successful and whatever is his aspirations or desires, they will be largely coming true. However, this combination also indicates that occasionally, once every five years, 10 years, there can be some serious health problems which can last for one, one and a half year. This is something regarding which the native have to be successful. Siblings are more or less a responsibility on the native or may not be able to help him very much. Mother is quite successful in life. However, father needs to be uh, father will be suffering, can have financial difficulties and a lot of enmity. Children are largely successful. The native will have to face competitions and losses because of enmity. The native will have multiple servants, but deception and deceiving by friends, employees, colleagues, servants can happen. This is not a very good setup for marriage and it generally indicates that family members will be disturbing the marital life of the native though it gives good longevity and almost a very steady health to the native and also indicates that the professional native will reach at high professional status and generally the professional condition of the native will be stable and will be progressing year after year as the native progresses in age. If the second lord is going into third house, then there can be some speech related issues. Maybe the person is misunderstood, speaks very fast, speaks very slow, stammers or other such issues can be there regarding which there should be. Regarding this, the native should be careful right from the starting. Second lord in third house also indicates that one can be harsh in speech, one can be criticizing, one can be very piercing in their speech and the way they present their words because of which they will have to suffer different type of losses and issues in their life. This is something that they should control. Second Lord in third house also indicates that income and saving will be fluctuating. Income will not be stable and person often, person will often have to come across situations where he will have to spend money or lose money despite the fact that he is not wanting to do it but he will be forced to do apart from that the native 
tries to enjoy in life the native is very comfort oriented very enjoyment oriented native wants to have a good life means to say the native is not having self contentment or self satisfaction as such right native is very aspirational but this aspirations hardly come true and 80% of the time the aspirations and desires of the native not completely but 20 to 30% remains unfulfilled apart from that the native can also make some wrong investments or can make some wrong decisions in life specifically major wrong decisions of having children at wrong time marrying a wrong life partner marrying a life partner which is not good for you can create major challenges in a life that is something that the native should be careful about cheating is related to property can happen this is another thing that the native should be careful about purchasing homeland property on loans is not advised at all loss of property loss of inheritance is also possible apart from that the native is born in a humble family and the family members are generally not in a position to support the native so he will have to do all the things by himself only siblings if any are not of much use their relationship with the native can also be problematic mother also suffers a lot in life and have to do a lot of hard work father also comes from a humble background and the life of the father is also troubled children do well these people succeed after childbirth in life however they can get enmity with some very strong people which can create disturbance and difficulties and hurdles in their life this is something that they should be careful about though their marital life is largely good but a lot of involvement of either your or siblings or spouses siblings will be very detrimental for marital life the native have to make sure to follow their dharma in marriage if they you know like if they try to avoid responsibilities in marriage or if they even have mental thoughts of having someone if even if they have mental thoughts of cheating then it will be very detrimental for their marital life most importantly i have seen these people can be obsessed with sexuality because of which their personal satisfaction and contentment is quite disturbed in life right generally surprise unfortunate events surprise misfortune strikes the native and disbalances the flow of life in profession challenges from authority and non cooperation of colleagues can be a major issue and the person to show off can spend more money then what he should actually do which will also disturb the financial status of the native if the second lord is in third house if the second lord is going in the fourth house it is quite a good combination native have multiple properties and multiple vehicles mother is well to do and this native can expect inheritance not only from the father's side but from the mother's side as well mother supports the native native gets complete happiness of mother in every respect because of family the native is secure in life generally in these cases the life of the native is set by the family members itself native have native is not needed to do much he just have to you know like be nice and do the bare minimum that one will be asked for and his life will be good this is generally a combination where a person lives tension free about their financial status because it is very good they are well supported by family also multiple properties they will have in inheritance also they will get it and they will also make multiple properties as well the voice the speech of the native is very soothing very pleasing very authoritative and working in areas where the where speech or communication is important will be very fruitful to the native however heart related issues cholesterol related issues can be in the life of the native so this is something that they should be careful about personal life home life family life is very good and native enjoys a lot with their family members which means to say that this largely indicates marital life is very good children are very good children are obedient life partner is loving you caring about you and personal life is almost tension free native do not have to worry about their day to day livings and about you know providing things to their family in these areas native is almost tension free 
it is also a combination which promotes love marriage or marriage to a life partner of your own choice so this result is also there and apart from that native generally enjoys mental peace native lives tension free right wearing good clothes having high level of resources and living a life of enjoyment contentment with a lot of resources is basically the result with second lord and fourth house so this is quite a very good setup generally the ideas of person with respect to property and land is largely successful and if the native is working in departments departments related to land property architecture then the native is quite successful the family of the native like in the childhood of father the family can be struggling but the father by his own hard work will take the family to high levels and by the birth or adolescence of the native the family will be in quite a good condition the good result of which the native will enjoy throughout his life siblings are also rich well to do they are well settled in their life and either they financially help the native or even if they don't help then at even if they don't help even in that scenario native will never have to worry about their siblings at all so this is a very good setup but it also indicates that the native may have female siblings and these female siblings can have troubled life also lot of gains from mother's side is already there that i have already discussed about with respect to children this combination can give delay in child birth and the children may struggle initially in their life but later on they also become successful and happy with enmity in enmity competition the native is largely successful in court cases litigations also the native is very successful the native is affluent have a lot of opulence multiple servants multiple people to help him is there generally the native can be businessman also where he is ruling over a large group of people so that is also a very brilliant combination the longevity is generally good the native generally lives disease free the profession of the native includes a lot of travel and because of profession the native can go to foreign lands also and the native is well supported by his by his seniors and colleagues both in his workplace so this is quite a good setup if the second lord is going in the ninth house uh, sorry going in the fifth house then the native is quite a visionary whatever his ideas are that will be successful all the dreams and aspirations will be realized anyone who even listens to their advice they will also be very very successful the native is visionary whatever he will say that will come true whatever he will plan it will work like that only it is a great dhan yoga the person will be rich the person will be affluent the person will have lot of objects of enjoyment he will live a life of affluence not only this the person will get a lot of inheritance from mother however the fortune of the father can be bit problematic right but mother's mother will be very well to do and mother will be supporting the native for sure siblings will have to do a lot of hard work in life but eventually they will be successful and they will also support the native gain of multiple properties and getting good resources in inheritance will be there the native will generally live an unobstructed life many enemies will not be there enemies will be easily slayed native will be victorious over enemies much competition will not be there and native will live a fairly easy life life partner is very supportive though life partner comes from a humble background but after marriage the life of the life partner and the life of the native himself will change for better this combination generally indicates good longevity good health stable health however as a bad result sometimes in 
profession the native may not get his due credit or the promotion or the professional benefits can be delayed native speaks well and if the native is in teaching and in those areas where the native have in those areas of profession where the native have to present his ideas then the native will be very very successful however the native is very susceptible to obesity and problems related to throat eating and stomach regarding which the native should be careful eye related troubles eyesight related issues can be there so the native should be careful about it this is a combination which generally indicates that the person will have multiple children and all of these children will also be successful and multiple children also mean that the person will be earning so huge that he will not only be able to take care of himself and his family but he will be able to take care of his dependents also so native is like a king where he is having many dependents as well so this is quite a good setup now coming to fifth lord second lord and sixth house <clears throat> Second Lord in sixth house. Sixth house is the house of disease. Second house is the house of speech. So speaking related issues, coarse voice, harsh voice, stammering. These things can be there. Problems related to mouth, face, throat can also be there. Problems from fooding, eating contaminated food, food poisoning, stomach related issues, digestion related issues can also be there. Eyesight related issues, vision related issues can also be there. right cheating in the matters of land and property can happen enmity because of land property can also happen the native can be the family members of the native can be inimical towards him so this is something that the native should be careful about generally the native comes from a family who themselves are struggling so family members are not of much help in fact the family members are more or less a liability on the native itself native will be forced quite early in life to the to take responsibility of his family members as the age progresses by because second sixth house is upachay and it means improving over time as the age passes by in old age the native can expect of financial success and financially good results but in the starting and the middle of life there will be financial difficulties taking loans is quite problematic the native should avoid taking loans under all cost otherwise it will eclipse the personal fortune and finances of the native right in the matters of property cheating litigations and other problems can be there so the native should be careful about it right the family will be big the family will be huge but will not be of much help to the native regarding siblings the siblings are dissatisfied in their personal life troubled in their personal life because of which they will not be able to do much help to the native generally mother comes from a very fortunate family but in her own life she is not very fortunate she will have to struggle a bit and may not provide many things to the native in fact second lord in sixth house because it indicates enmity with the family members more or less indicates that no family members is of any use to the native in fact they are more like a liability on the native children will be very successful in their personal life however they will not be much useful to the native or they can be as i said family members can be a problem on the native liability on the native so more or less the children and the spouse also is more or less a liability on the native also native as well second lord in sixth house is not a very good combination for marriage also this is generally a combination where it is indicated that native will marry a life partner with whom their horoscopes their thoughts does not match and it can also indicate separation and divorce in marriage if other combinations are not good with respect to longevity this generally gives a long life however it is filled with multiple type of health problems regarding which the native should be careful the father is spiritual the father is fortunate but the father if the father is in government job then the father is not having a good relationship with the native otherwise though the father is spiritual and a good person but he will have many enmities and challenges in his life because of which he himself will be dissatisfied and struggling in his life and he will not be able to help the native much in profession the native will do slow and steady progress and 
second lord in 9000 does indicate that professionally you will have a position which is which cannot be challenged but this position will be achieved in the last part of life in old in old age around retirement only and most importantly much professional competitions uh, much professional competition will be there there will be a large group of people who are professionally large group of professional contacts who are largely dissatisfied or angry over the native angry from the native over the native whatever and in professional life the native have to have self contentment and satisfaction because generally in this combination native does not get 100% of what he deserves but only 20 to 25% of what he actually deserves right so self satisfaction contentment in the matter of uh, professional life is something that have to be exercised otherwise it is not a very good combination for it second lord if it is going in seventh house the native is very kind hearted very kind hearted so kind hearted so kind hearted that the goodness of the native is the weakness of the native people will misuse this native thrash this native do bad to this native but he will do he will want to do good with everyone he will want to be an idol of goodness because of which he will be cheated thrashed humiliated in life this is something that they should be very careful about they have a very pure heart but people misuse their goodness so this is something that the native should be careful about financially the native will be successful more so after marriage right life partner will be financially well to do following the advice of the life partner is very good for native it will make the native fortunate rich after marriage financial condition will improve however the family members of the life partner or the family members of the native can be problematic in marital life so they should be kept at a distance apart from that it is not a very good combination for the sustenance of first marriage second marriage onwards it is a very good combination but it is a bad combination for first marriage it does indicate because of the same reason it does indicate multiple marriages as well right the native have a good speech the native have an authoritative speech and anyone who listens to the speech who listens to native who follows the native will largely be successful native will be blessed by the goddess saraswati and whatever he will say that will come true native have great foresight his plans will always work and whatever is his whatever he is anticipating about things that will largely come true right native can have native will have very good eyes however throat related issues and throat related complaints can be there gain of multiple properties both in homeland and outside will be there native initially in childhood is supported by the family members but later on as the native grows in life after marriage there will be enmity competition and distance with family members which is only good for the native generally second lord and seventh house if the native is very attached to their family members then they are not successful they become successful only when they go away from their family members or when they change their birthplace in their birthplace they are not very successful health problems are also there because second lord marak is going in the seventh house it is not a very good setup for health and more or less health problems are there regarding which the native should be very very careful family life is not very good bad relationship between siblings between parents between parents and siblings can be there which will be disturbing the personal life of the native <clears throat> right which will be disturbing the personal life of the native the siblings are generally fortunate more so after childbirth the children of the siblings are also very good and they are much attached to the native as well the middle ages of the the middle ages or the young age what you call jawani of siblings is largely very good mother is well to do native can expect inheritance from mother also native will get good love care and support from mother however as i told you after marriage this care support etc from mother can be lacking so this is something that uh, th that should be predicted second lord and seventh house is not a very good combination for childbirth generally it denies childbirth or the children can be born with mental or physical difficulties right but such predictions which are huge should not be predicted based on one small formula of second lord and seventh house only other factors should be judged accordingly in enmity competition the native is almost indefeatable the native is almost invincible 
he wins over his enemies he is successful over his enemies but at the same point of time he have many enemies many people are jealous of him he is all also having many servants the native will rule high in life in business the native will be very successful he will have many employees under him but at the same point of time he will have multiple enemies also who will want to do every type of damage to the native right from putting false allegations to putting false cases on the native regarding which the native should be careful this is not a very good combination for longevity as such i already told you that it is a bad combination for health so this is something that the native should be careful about the father is largely successful in the middle and the second half of life because of which the native because the father will be successful in middle and later part of life and the native will be born in the middle ages of the father itself because of which the native will get a good father and good support from family at least in their childhood days but good relationship with father cordial relationship with father living with father is something that i don't see in these cases and some kind of bad result with relationship with father or through the or the manifestation of the same through the absence of father is generally present in the life of the native when the second lord is coming in the eighth house he is expecting the second house back native will have a very good speech very authoritative speech and if the native is working in the matters related to speech then the native will be very very successful areas related to speech the native will be very very successful right this also gives good longevity to the native native comes from good well to do family childhood is good because of which native gets good education there is good start to career there is good there is good start to uh, education there is good start to profession generally in business the native is quite successful however the native is wealthy also because the second lord is expecting the second house back so native is wealthy but the point is because eight thousand indicates misfortune and sudden changes because of sudden misfortune sudden calamities financial difficulties can arise and there can be significant loss of money throat related face related mouth related stomach related issues and complaints can be there eye related issues and complaints can also be there person can be cheated in the matters of land and property so this is something that the native should be careful about the native will generally be tensed there will be a lot of responsibility on the native multiple useless responsibility also that should not be on the native will also be there which will disturb the native however the native will be supported by the family members he will have large family and later on he will own multiple properties as well native will live a life of enjoyment contentment and happiness but in the later part of life after 35 40 only not before that it is a bad combination for though it gives long life but it is a bad combination for health more or less health problems are there the native because of sudden losses or sudden bad things happening around native sudden bad things means something which the native does not understand about right some person have talked bad about you behind your back because of which you lose your job and other such things generally create difficulties in the life of the native because of which the native largely can be said to be unfortunate right so this is a combination which needs proper administration of remedies the siblings of the native are generally diseased and they need a lot of help and support from the native right so a lot of dependency a lot of responsibility of the siblings will be on the native mother is well to do and native will generally get help support inheritance from mother also however in childhood getting complete love care affection of mother is quite difficult children are successful in their own life and regarding children the native don't have to worry much this is not a very good combination for father generally the father is also troubled with enmity and diseases it is not a very good combination for the happiness from father also so the father can be unavailable or can be separated from the native this can happen so regarding this also the native should be careful and this is the result that will happen native should be careful not to make relationship with their father more tensed it is a good combination in the matters of 
profession generally the native will enjoy good professional position good professional status and income from the profession will be very good in the main profession that the native is doing he will be earning 2-3% more than what he is actually deserving so this is a very good combination regarding marriage this combination is good for the sustenance of marriage until and unless the family of yourself or your life partner starts interfering in marriage which should not be the case at all point one secondarily taking help and advice from the parents and family members of your spouse will be very good for you generally this combinations indicate generally this combination indicate that you will outdate or live more than your life partner it indicates this right second lord in ninth house the native can have speech problems speech defects the native can be misunderstood in their speech right but the native can change it and it is a good good speech and better way of presenting things is what will take the native to higher levels of life will make the native more fortunate more successful more happy <clears throat> right so native should work on his speech very much needed the native will be wealthy and because second lord is coming into ninth house the luck will support your wealth so whenever money is needed you will get it by luck because of which the needs will be fulfilled always mostly desires are also fulfilled the native lives a life of enjoyment not because he deserves it but purely because of luck regarding i this can create eye troubles one will get inheritance especially from their father's side one gets much love support care from father and father actually lives for the native and leave a lot of things for the native if the native becomes a guru becomes a teacher guides people he will be quite successful native can earn money through government or through governmental contacts also being a spiritual visiting temples daily doing religious sacrifices is very beneficial for the native that the native should do 100% the family the relationship with family members except with father can be troubled and challenging so that is something that the native should be careful about the siblings can have bad multiple bad marital life and bad relationships bad personal relationships which will occasionally disturb the personal life of the native as well this is something regarding which the native should be careful the mother mother can have a lot of health problems mother will belong from a well to do family but in her middle ages she must have lost almost everything right the children of the native will be fairly successful right and the children of the native will also enjoy good position in life native will generally be without enmity much competition much struggle much hardships will not be in the life of the native however native will native will be fortunate as in he will have many servants and many many servants to help him many people to help him also apart from that the native have almost no enemies even if there are few enemies to the native they will be destroyed all by themselves so this is something that the native should be carefree about in professional life there can be loss of professional position without any direct mistake of the native so misfortune in the matters of professional life is something that is prominently seen with this combination this is something that the native should be careful about sometimes person who is less competent than the native can be given a given an upper position it will look like that professionally injustice is happening to the native so regarding which after proper analysis and remedies etc should be done as per the horoscope second lord in 10th house 
the profession is financially rewarding. That means to say person have high professional status, earns well from his profession. Works related to speaking <clears throat> or doing any work which have something to do with eyes, seeing or speaking will be very good for the native. Stomach related complaints can be there. Native will be living a life of happiness, enjoyment, contentment and affluence. affluence opulence. Eye related troubles can be there. Some major ideas of the natives, some major investments can fail leading to misfortune. So whenever you are implementing on an idea or investing something, be extra careful. <clears throat> Plan out things two, three times. Only then it will be good. Person gains property, makes property in the later part of life. So any property that you are making between 30, 35, make sure that you are not going to be very firm that you are not going to live in this for very, very long. Native comes from a very prestigious and noble family lineage. And the family members are largely very supportive to the native. Native enjoys high position in their professional life. The siblings of the native generally have troubled life and health problems they can also have. Mother is successful. The mother may have to travel a lot. And in the middle ages, mother can suffer in life. The relationship between mother and father will not be very good as such. The children's also, it is a bad combination for childbirth and the children's also will struggle in their life, specifically with respect to settlement and their own professional life. The, net, the enmity and competition and jealousy of people can negatively impact the professional life of the native as well. The colleagues and people working under the native can be largely dissatisfied and they can go against the native, revolt against the native. The marital life is not very happy. There is compromise in marital life and with a lot of involvement of the family members in marriage, the marital life can be bad also. And if a lot of family members or if there is a high involvement of family members in marriage, then it can indicate it can turn into a combination of divorce or separation as well. The father will be struggling in the matters of finances and generally the father is not able to provide much to the native. Second Lord in 11th house, I already told you that the native is rich. Earns good amount of money, have financial security, lives a life of enjoyment, opulence, have multiple things, multiple properties, multiple vehicles the native is having. Native is having great foresight. His ideas will come true. His plans will work. In fact, people listening to his advice will also be very prosperous. Though the native does not get support from his family, mother, father, siblings, but his own family, his wife, children will be very supportive to the native. Right. The native comes from a noble, prestigious, well-to-do family because of which the childhood of the native is almost good. Almost very good. However, this support etc. of the family member is not able to do much good, is not able to give a very good start to the native. Because generally native chooses a profession or takes some very major decisions in their 20s, which can upset their parents because of which the support of the parents can be largely missing. The siblings of the native will be successful in their old age. So in childhood and middle ages, they will be struggling because of which they will be a responsibility over the native. The mother can be unfortunate in her life and mother may lose a lot of money, do take uh, can take very bad decisions in life because of which the childhood of the native and the condition of the mother can be problematic. <clears throat> so this is something that is there. This is not a very good combination for childbirth. Childbirth, there can be delays in childbirth and generally the native and the children of the native live separated. And if they live together, then their progress is hampered. Much love, support, care from the children cannot be expected as such. 
the native will have enmity with people people will be jealous of him people will want to be competitive about him and many a times they will the enemies because of their conspiracy because of their activities can create losses to the native also but the native should be ignorant about it only if the native is ignorant then these enemies will automatically disappear the native is victorious over enemies but if he pays more attention to enmity then it will keep on increasing only so this is something that the native should be careful about it is not a very good combination for childbirth i already told you so this is there there can be false allegations and defamation of life partner in this particular combination because of this particular combination as well the life partner can have stomach digestion excretion related issues also and the middle ages of the life partner can be quite troubled and challenging the professional life of the life partner can also be troubled and challenging this is not a very good combination for long life so either the person is having middle life or the person will be having constant health problems though these health problems are not very serious but these are constant health problems right so constant problem of headache turning into migraine and such issues such problems are there the father will have to struggle a lot in life the father because of his siblings the paternal uncles of the native he will have to suffer and struggle in life and father will not get support from his siblings which will make the life of the father difficult eventually making the life of the native difficult in profession the native will be able to earn good amount of money from his profession and generally the native will be satisfied from his professional life and professionally he will be well to do it is a combination for riches also second lord and 12th house technically it should indicate that the saved money is going for a loss but if the planet is saturn he will be expecting second house back he can make you very rich also apart from that second lord and 12th house will be indicating that the native can lose a lot of money right but what if you start losing money by planning through investment it is a very good combination for that second lord in 12th house if the native is making investments then the native is very successful where to make investments 12th house indicates foreign lands also so investments in foreign lands is good foreign lands is good apart from that investment in things signified by the rashi and the planet in the 12th house is recommended generally fluctuations in wealth loss of major amount of money loss of money because of some bad decisions or bad investments is generally indicated in this combination there can be problems related to speech stammering etc problems related to eyesight can be there the plans and ideas of the native may not work he can be deceived by people health problems can trouble the native a lot this is a combination which indicates curtailment of longevity also so it should be analyzed accordingly problems related to face throat eating excretion stomach will be there though the native is aspirational and wants to live a life of enjoyment but he will be often troubled by family conditions and he will be often troubled by surprise calamities that will be before that will be befalling over the native major losses in property or because of property can also be there family will be more or less a responsibility on the native and native will have to spend money to take care of the family members and help and support them specifically siblings will be a liability on the native right because of which the native will also have to lose quite a good amount of money the family members will be well to do in their own personal lives but they will not want to help the native much so this thing will be their mother will be fortunate and mother can help the native a bit but much help i don't expect until and unless other supportive conditions are there later on in life after the age of 40 45 native will be fortunate in the matters of property and can have multiple lands and properties to his name not a very good combination for childbirth the children can struggle in their own life and 
children generally don't give much happiness to the native the native is generally troubled by disease many enemies are there who obstruct the path of the native creates disturbance in the life of the native because of which the native can live in mental tension mental troubles also the native can be permanently tensed because of which problems health problems because of tension can also be there it is also a combination which does not indicate a very good marital life fights with life partner enmity competition with life partner divorce separation in marriage can also be there if not then life partner will have a bad health the personal life of the life partner will be challenged can be troubled because of which the marital life of the native will also take a hit the father in life the father will be successful and well to do in childhood but in middle ages the fortune of the father will fluctuate because uh, whose bad impact will also be felt in the life of the native because the combination is in the horoscope of the native and the father starting from his middle age till the old age will lose many properties and eventually will become a dissatisfied complaining person which will significantly reduce the happiness of father that the native is getting in professional life the native will have to do a lot of hard work but after consistent and dedicated hard work in professional life eventually after the age of 35 40 the native can be professionally successful as well and if the native goes to foreign lands or stays away from his family then many of these bad results can be mitigated and it will be converted into good results so i have told you so this is how these the the second lord in all the 12 houses should be analyzed and in a nutshell but covering extensively the result in the second house i have told you and your duty as an astrological student should be to note down what i am telling you and then think why i am telling you this the principles you know this series is very invaluable because the principles that i am teaching in this series do not explicitly mentioning the principles but using the principles to tell you the result these principles i actively use in my consultations also right so you should decode why i am saying one particular thing and even if you decode four things that i am telling you your astrological level will be greatly enhanced so do this take some good astrological lessons from the videos and i will consider my effort successful thank you for watching the video